Hey there, electricity enthusiasts. Welcome back to Electricity Frenzy. Today, we're diving into a very practical skill that's a must-know for DIY electricians and anyone interested in understanding more about their home's electrical system. We're talking about how to safely measure the voltage of your home's AC electricity using a multimeter. So, let's get into it and start measuring. Before we jump in, remember, that safety is key when working with electricity. Never touch exposed wires, and always ensure your hands are dry and you're standing on a dry surface. Ready? Let's do this. First up, you'll need a digital multimeter, the go-to tool for any electrical measurements. These devices are fantastic for diagnosing electrical issues or just getting to know your home's electrical system. To measure AC voltage, you're going to want to set your multimeter to measure voltage in the AC range. Look for the V symbol with a wavy line above it on your multimeter dial. That's the setting for AC voltage, which is what we have in our homes. Now, let's talk about the probes. Multimeters come with two probes, one red and one black. For measuring household AC voltage, you'll plug the black probe into the port usually labeled COM for common, and the red probe goes into the port labeled with a V or sometimes V omega ma for voltage measurements. With your multimeter set to AC voltage and your probes in the right ports, it's time to measure. But remember, we're dealing with potentially dangerous voltages here, so if you're not confident, please consult a professional. For those proceeding, let's do this safely. Measuring voltage. Ready to measure? Remember, we're dealing with live wires, so proceed with caution. If unsure, call an electrician. Approach your wall outlet, and carefully insert the black probe into one of the slots, and the red probe into the other slot. It doesn't matter which one goes where when measuring AC voltage, which is a bit different from measuring DC where polarity matters. As soon as both probes make contact with the outlet, your multimeter will display the voltage. In the United States, you should see a reading of around 120 volts. This can vary slightly depending on your location and the time of day, but it's generally around that figure. And that's it. You've successfully measured the AC voltage of your home outlet. Pretty simple, right? Understanding how to safely measure voltage is a fantastic first step into the wider world of home electrical work and DIY projects. Ready to make your electrical measurements as straightforward as possible? Check out our recommended auto-ranging multimeter in the video description below. It's a game changer for both beginners and seasoned pros. Click the link to see it in action and simplify your DIY electrical projects today. The multimeter I used in this video has the auto-ranging option, let me explain it to you. Imagine you're baking and the recipe calls for a pinch of salt. But what if you had a super fancy measuring spoon that automatically knew exactly how much pinch meant? That's kind of like an auto-ranging multimeter for electricity. Instead of fiddling with dials and guessing which measurement range you need, this handy feature does the thinking for you. It's like your multimeter has a little brain inside, saying, oh, hey, you're trying to measure voltage? Let me pick the perfect setting for you. Here's the cool part. Faster measurements, no more wasted time switching ranges if your guess was off. Just stick the probes in, and bam! Accurate reading. Beginner friendly, no need to stress about choosing the right setting. Your multimeter's got your back. Less room for error, no more accidentally choosing the wrong range and getting confusing readings. Think of it like this. Manual range setting, it's like using a regular measuring spoon, adjusting it yourself based on your estimate. Auto ranging, it's like having a magic measuring spoon that automatically adjusts to the perfect amount, no guessing needed. So, whether you're a seasoned electrician or just starting out, an auto ranging multimeter can make your life, and measurements, much easier. Plus, it's one less thing to worry about, so you can focus on the fun stuff, like fixing that wonky light fixture or building your next electronic project. Thanks for tuning in to Electricity Frenzy. If you found this guide helpful, give us a thumbs up, and don't forget to subscribe for more helpful tips and tricks. Stay safe, and I'll see you in the next video.